Aloha, it's Pastor Keith for morning prayer from Christ Lutheran Church in Mililani Town in the island of Oahu. And I'm coming to you from uh, the church sanctuary itself. You can see uh, behind me, uh, sorta, kinda, our, uh, our one stained glass window. It's got Jesus with outstretched arms uh, welcoming everyone. This is from the letter of James, the first chapter starting with the second verse. James writes, My brothers and sisters, whenever you face trials of any kind, consider it nothing but joy, because you know that the testing of your faith produces endurance. And let endurance have its full effect, so that you may be mature and complete, lacking in nothing. If any of you is lacking in wisdom, ask God, who gives it all generously and ungrudgingly. It will be given. But ask in faith, never doubting, for the one who doubts is like a wave of the sea driven and tossed by the wind. For the doubter, being double-minded and unstable in every way, must not expect to receive anything from the Lord. Let the believer who is lowly boast in being raised up, and the rich in being brought low, because the rich will disappear like a flower in the field. For the sun rises with its scorching heat and withers the field. Its flower falls and its beauty perishes. It is the same way with the rich. In the midst of a busy life, they will wither away. So, we pray for the reversal of all things, the poor lifted up, the rich brought low, the faithful to encounter their doubts and the doubters to encounter their faith. You know, faith and doubt are the flip side. Faith is how we trust. Doubt is how we work out whom it is we really trust. Who is this God, Jesus, creator, sanctifier, who saves us? That is a daily struggle, daily renewal, and it's dangerous. It can get scary. So we pray for protection through life. O oh God, full of compassion, I commit and I commend myself to you in him whom I live and move and have my being. Be the goal of my pilgrimage and my rest by the way. Give me refuge from turmoil of worldly distractions beneath the shadow of your wings. Let my heart, so often a sea of restless waves, find peace in you, O oh God, through Jesus Christ, my Lord. Amen. And now may our mothering God, the creator, the redeemer, and the sanctifier, shelter and protect you beneath her mothering wings, keeping you safe throughout this day. Amen.